So Riversdale Flats is the headwaters of the Waimakariri River. It's a thousand hectares. It was set aside in 1901 as a reserve for national park purposes. It's surrounded by Arthur's Pass National Park and by mistake in 1956 it was added into the Mount White pastoral lease before the area was added to Arthur's Pass National Park. The Riversdale Flats themselves are these beautiful dry land terraces that are um, typical of the Canterbury High Country and these areas are incredibly underprotected in the Protected Areas program that we have. The Riversdale Flats are home to a unique and underrepresented ecosystem that deserves our protection. There are Matagauri and tussocks that could be hundreds of years old, as well as many species of native insects and nesting grounds for native birds. Unfortunately, the golden brown beauty of the flats is at risk of being lost forever. Riversdale lease was transferred to the new owner of Mount White, and that means that it will be much, much more difficult to add it to Arthur's Pass National Park. In 2016, several consents were granted for land use change on the Riversdale Flats. This puts them at risk of being turned into yet another patch of green grass at the expense of a unique tussock ecosystem. Tussock lands are already underrepresented by the national park system and we really can't afford to lose their distinctive biodiversity.